As always, I forgot that chat was a thing. Had to set that up. Was a little bit busy with the more technical aspects of the stream. There we go. Chat is up now. If you said anything before, please say it again. <laughs> I can see it. All right. Wow. We're we're actually pretty far in. Five hours. This is uh, going to be the first world that I haven't seen yet. I had seen uh, Moody Maze. Get the volume right. There we go. Play's not too low for you. Um, should be fine though. So this is the first world that I hadn't seen in a trailer, hadn't seen anywhere else. So I'm pretty curious to see how it fares. Okay. It's weird how, like, does this game have, like, straight streaming? I mean, oh. Oh yeah, this is a thing. I completely forgot. It's a new mechanic. Whoa, wait, what's that? Oh. Ah, alright. No, it's the other way around. There we go. Oh, come on, come on. There we go. What are these guys? Are they like the normal baddies dressed up as? No, they're different. They have the same animation though. I I really don't like the lack of variety of these like small enemies. I wish there there was more differentiation there were different attacks different uh patterns to them but they move and even sound exactly the same which honestly it's such such a bummer man like whoa what poisonous how i wish this game was better than i'm finding it to be it's enjoyable it's a lot better than the first time i tried uh playing it but Still, I wish it were more. Alright, now I'm gonna actually get to read this. Hey there, Mr. or Mrs. Pumpkin. We're on the hunt for pages. Have you seen any? Hello, lizard. Piece of paper get cut in a trap over there. Trap activated by sound of splashing. So lizard keep feet dry. Alright, oh. Thank you for the tip. I wish... Don't turn the camera like that. Not helpful. Ah... Uh, you gotta... You gotta be quick. Hello! Is the game audio good? Is there no game audio? Oh no. Stop everything. Do I need to fix game audio? Boom. There we go. Should be better now. Thank you. Thank you. Why did I have it that low? Tell me if it's better now. Yeah, it was... For some reason. There we go. Oh yeah, how are you doing, Kaya? I was just, uh, talk- oh, it's the fighting dude. Come on. Just talking how this is the first one I haven't seen in trailers this level, so I'm kind of curious to see how it's going to- Ah. I don't like this guy. This guy's the most annoying one of all. What? Come on, come on. Come on. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. 
I hope you feel better. I hate when days like that happen. That was yesterday for me. I... I had a pretty, pretty bad day. Wasn't feeling well all day. They kind of look like teddy bear. No, they're not. They're like... The mushrooms on their heads looked like barriers, but they're just, uh... Mossy mushrooms. I'm kind of lost in here. Not very sure where to go. I'm doing all right. I'm, again, way better than yesterday. Uh, um, today's been a pretty good day. Um, oh, oh. How do I get you out of there? Did I pop this bubble again? No, I think that's okay. It's been a pretty good day. I haven't done much. Uh, I finally, after a long, long time, actually got a good night of sleep. Like, I've been having some terrible nights. Terrible, terrible nights. And, uh... Finally, <laughs> I slept a really good amount of time. I slept, I think, 11 hours. <laughs> uh, it's, um... It's a holiday here, so... Um... So, it's, uh... You know, pretty good. Been pretty good. Uh, go in here. Sleeping in. So, <laughs> I've only really had time to, like, eat lunch. And, uh... That's it. So many of these, I, I don't know what to do here. Oh. Okay. Oh, oh. This is harder than it looks. Yeah, I like these past few nights. I've been sleeping like uh no, no, no. I've been what sleeping like 2 to 3 hours tops. So, like it was a much needed rest. But, uh, yeah, 11 hours is a lot of time, too. <laughs> um, ooh. This is actually pretty challenging. As far as these little puzzle types go. Hey, where's the opening? Is it here? Okay. Okay. 14 seconds. Yeah! This world seems a lot more compact than the previous ones. At least so far. It feels like... It feels less open. I guess it's because it's a maze. It just feels... smaller more, uh, linear than before, too. But at the same time, you can just, like, cross over the top of the maze, so... It's a weird one. Oh, I heard a hee-hee-hee. Where? What, what's up with these guys? Can I break them? I can probably do something to them. Can I step here? It looked like moss. I, don't, I hate the the laughing guy. It bothers me. Ah, uh, where are you? Yeah. Yeah. 
Everything looks the same here. <laughs> Is this right? This is where it just was, right? Yeah, it is. Okay, I'm I'm walking in circles now. Um, I'll go that away. Is this in? Oh, that's poison water. I don't want to go there. This is no. Oh no, this is poison water too. <laughs> this is all poison water. Oh no. Here, get out of here. Hello? Are you friendly? What's up with you? Are you just lights? I bet I'm gonna turn into a pumpkin in this level. Feels like a good pumpkin level. Spider. Oh! Where, where are you? Where's Trouser? I hear him. Is he like right under here? Oh, he is. <laughs> hey, Trouser. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Welcome, friends. How lovely to see you. <laughs> All right, sausage features. The feds haven't caught up with you yet, then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been thinking about launching a Trouser patented drone delivery business. <laughs> Your moves delivered right to your doorstep, along with an expert instruction video by myself. What do you think? I wouldn't trust you to deliver my takeaway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Super! I'm great to have your support. Now, why don't we have a look at what's in stock? Lizard Lash reach high points with a simple maneuver. Or Sonar Explosion. It's a bit naughty, this move, but don't use it near glass. 2% off. Yeah. Oh, actually, yeah. yeah. Oh. Because I'm rich, I'm swimming in feathers. Uh, oh, I, I completely forgot. Must be recognized by my meticulous technique. Ridiculous physique, more like. Oh. Laylee, go on, Trouser. What do you have for us? With Lizard Lash, our lizard friend will be able to attach to special grapple points by facing towards them and pressing B. You can launch across gaps, attach to scenery, and more. Sounds great. We'll come back if we need a reminder. And the sonar explosion. Top choice, blah blah blah. Don't use it near glass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. With Sonar Explosion, you can emit devastating sonic boom. Sonic boom! For, to stun all enemies. What? Sounds decent. I'm cautiously optimistic this one won't be ru rubbish. How does it work then, Wormy? Yeah, yeah. To use it, Sonar Explosion, just simply hold left trigger and Y. Okay. Yeah, yeah. You might want to purchase some migraine tablets too. This moves real head banger. Awesome. Yeah, yeah. See you again, remember, pals. You can never have too many moves. Yeah, you can. Oh, you need a hole? Oh. That was pretty powerful. I'm guessing that... Lizard latch isn't working. I'm guessing, like, I'm supposed to latch onto these pumpkins. But... Browser, I need help. <laughs> yeah. Actually, no, I don't. I have I have a move menu. Oh, really? oh. Hmm. Uh. Oh, moves info. I'm like right. <laughs> yeah, I couldn't see it. Uh. Oh, oh, that's what the spiders are for. Okay. Okay. Oh, and that breaks those. Already can get more pages in the other worlds. Yeah. Oh, look, the next move is how to evade from cameras. I should have just looked here. <laughs> Would have figured out that we can do the, the camera part. Um. Alright. 
to places like the. Can I? Yeah. What's over here? Was I here before? I was. Okay. Right? Right? Yeah, I haven't pressed this in. Okay, no. Can I can't swim it. Here, run it. I can't go into racing mode. Okay. No, no. <laughs> All right. That is gonna be pretty hard. Wait, camera, camera, no. No, let me turn. Okay. I'm second yet. Yeah, okay, I can't use my, my dash. Uh. What's the fastest way to swim? Can I walk through here? Oh, I can jump it. Yes, of course. MLG Pro moves right there. <laughs> Clearly. Not on accident at all. <laughs> this level is very. Pull it, pull it, pull it! Is really reminding me of the, of the horror ep uh, episode. The horror level in A Hat in Time. Like, it's, it seems very similar because both of them are like these woodedy areas. They're not just, you know, like a horror haunted mansion or something. Kind of interesting that both of them decided to go with this. I- Oh, oh, I see. Oh, I'm running low. Now. Um, this kind of haunted woods vibe. That's the woods. The woods, no, the swamp. Oh, this is all swamp. Can't walk on that. That's where I was trying to get across. There's something over there. I'm gonna try getting there? It was there, though. Uh, I don't think I've been over there. I'm curious about... Whoa! Play coin, play coin! Oh, I didn't get hurt. Okay. Get This is where I, yeah, I just needed to look back. Nice. Let's do some Frogger here. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Too pro for words. <laughs> you just gotta... Pros just mumble. If you watch any pro tour, they're just like... Ah! Talking on the mic. Hey, hey. 
funny thing, like, it's true for some games. They, they understand what they're saying to each other. I have no clue the few times that I've ever tried watching pro games of... I was trying to watch Overwatch. And they just go crazy. <laughs> it's like, oh, what are you saying? Please explain. Uh, oh. Hey, not... Did I kill it? Oh! No, 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 no! <laughs> the worst. Shouldn't I? Oh, I am doing it. Okay. okay. Ah. Ah. I see. Is that time? Ooh, too many buttons. This level is very buttony. What's going on? What's going on? Don't get it. Oh. Make it, make it. Oh, I need it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm starting to get the hang of the layout of this place. I think I just need to go over there. Timing! By the way, have you ever played a game called, uh, it's either Little Big Adventure 2 or Little Big Adventure, this series in general. Or Twinson's Adventure or Twinson's Odyssey. It came out back in the 90s. I've been trying to find people that have played that. So far, I'm the only person I know that has. It has a very, like, small community online, and I kind of really want to find people that... that have played that. Um... Yeah. It's the little things. Like, the fire shouldn't be showing up behind the pipe. <laughs> the little things, as always. Windows! <laughs> thank you, Windows. Thank you for- thank you. Thank you. <laughs> you gotta love Windows. Alright. Try doing this again. It doesn't give me a lot of time. I think I have time. One more, one more. Come on. Six seconds. Yeah. Yeah, these are a little bit tougher. Oh, it's dropping the water. Nice. Oh no, it's just making it not poisonous. Oh, those have already sorted out your switches for me, and I didn't even have to ask. I bet it robbed us all of all kinds of fascinating exposition. Here, take this bit of paper I found and a coke pie as a reward. Use the servant. Yeah, for doing things out of order. Hmm. Kaya says, no, I've never heard of it. Yeah, I, I still haven't met anyone that has played that. It's such a great game. It's very, it's like... Oh, I could have just talked to him here. Um, oh, accident. Thanks again for your help for us, well. Why not go for a swim in the lovely f Oh yeah, probably stuff down there. Um... It reminds me of Zelda not in theme, but like in gameplay where like, uh... It's an adventure game where you get new items as you go. But the great thing about it is that... I mostly play 2. 2 I think really... Improved on 1's mechanics and uh... Oh, I forgot I can do this now. And... It, like... 
gives you items and stuff to be able to advance, but it's very narrative-based, which was uh, very much a rarity. Uh, I know, I know. Like, especially for... There we go. For, like, at least to me back in the day. It was a PC game. It came out to, for... I don't think the second one came out for anything. Now that the first one was on PS1. Um, but, um... Hmm. I don't like this. But it wasn't... So I say, like, gameplay reminds of Zelda, but it wasn't medieval-type gameplay. It was modern day. Like, fantasy modern day, where it's like, there's magic, but there are cars. And it was very, like, don't think a realistic looking game. It was very cartoony. And, uh, very simple looking. But... It was, it was a very good game. And that was, I think, the last game that studio made. Um, which is a, a real bummer, because it was really, they were really good. I was a real fan of their games. Um, they also made one that's way more famous, is uh, Alone in the Dark. That was a famous horror game from back then, they also made that. Um, wait, what does that do? It's in Europe, I think it was Little Big Adventure. This one I'm talking about specifically is Little Big Adventure 2. And in the Americas, I think they switched it to, to uh, Twinson's Odyssey. Um, that being number two. The first one was called Twinson's Adventure. Like, twin... Like the word twin and S-E-N altogether. Twin Sen. Great game. Great game. That's like, it could also be that I have like nostalgia goggles for that, because I play that as a child. I watch my father play it, uh, but after playing it in modern day, obviously it has like some older controls, of course, right? But it's still a fantastic game if you can like get used to the controls, I guess. But if you're used to controls from that era, it shouldn't be too much trouble. How do I move this? Oh, I need to turn on the air. How do I turn on the air? Probably over here. Does it stay open? Oh, no. There we go. This level's actually really well done, this section. It's, uh, using just the classic way of teaching you how to do something. It teaches you a concept, and then builds on it naturally throughout the level. This is fun. I'm a fan. This adds challenge to it. I like it. These are good game designers. It just sucks that the overall game is, like... It doesn't feel like it's up to par with what they usually used to make. Um... And yes, I was gonna finish talking about that game, but- ah! <laughs> the jellyfish. Okay, this is, I'm guessing, the exit. Get me out, get me out of here. Before I mention your other comment, uh, of course we love Windows, yeah. They're the worst, they always have updates showing up. You're a thing. Oh. Help! I'm getting jabbed by those thorns down here. 
Oh, I know. No? Oh. Um, let's see what else. That's the entrance I came out of. I haven't been to that one. Um, they, they really are the worst. We, we deal with them because they're the only option we have. Obviously we have like a Linux or Mac, but none of them have all the support that Windows has just because of how much Windows has propagated throughout everything and it sucks. I wish it wasn't so. I wish they had more competition for the things they do so that we had the option to choose. And then they would have to work for their updates. Even though... <laughs> Windows 10, a lot better than Windows 8. A lot better than Windows Vista. What do I do here? I know I can break glass with my scream. Oh, really? No. Okay. Also, this is super janky. <laughs> There's something in there? There is. Oh, it's a ghost, buddy. Don't ha 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 me. You can't escape. Well, I guess you can. Yeah, I know, right? The jellyfish only want cuddles. That's what I think about, like, all the enemies in, like, Mario, Zelda's. They're not doing anything. They're just walking. The Especially in the new, like, 2D Mario games. They're, they're dancing to the music. They're having fun. Mario's the real enemy. You're the real enemy as the player. <laughs> they have... They haven't done anything to deserve you... ...killing them. Can I really not blow this up with... Huh. They're innocent. They're all innocent. Except for Mario. Mario's just... Wahoo! Up and down... <laughs> ...the street. And jumping on people in the new game, possessing people, you know, there's a, uh, there's a great, oh, this is what I have to use. There's this great video I found <laughs> that it's just like, it's Mario and the human people city that's in the new game. Really? It goes through the glass? <laughs> Come on. So yeah, it's Mario in the normal human people. Wow, this glass is really good. Um, I keep getting sidetracked. The normal human, human people, uh, city. And then there's just two dudes in a cafe talking about, you know, whatever. Taxes, I don't know. And, uh, I need to, I need to link that, that, uh, that short. And then Mario just comes like, wahoo, throws a hat at one of the dudes. And then, you know, possesses him and then just goes around like a madman. <laughs> My favorite part is when Mario leaves him. He literally barfs up Mario. It's like the grossest thing. And the other guy that was with him called the police and everything. And he's just like, yeah, the Mario, the Mario just possessed me. And I don't remember, I only watched it once. I thought it was really good. Though. Um, how do I do it? Can I do anything here? I have to kill you guys? I have to go on a murder rampage Mario style? Clearly they give me tools to kill. They gave me like these things, which... Okay, I'm gonna die. But yeah, Mario, the new Mario coming out was... This year has been a dream for me. Because again, all these games I'm playing, everything. I love platformers. And uh, <laughs> this game has had so many of them. This one. A hat in time. The new Mario, probably more. I just don't know. And this so obviously is meant for me to break it. And it's driving me insane. Do I have any other powers? I know it, there's a platform up there. I have no idea how to get there. Um, 
This game is full of things like the like this, where like you have no clue if you're supposed to go or not somewhere yet. Like it's the yet thing. You don't know if you have the power up necessary. Okay, I'm gonna look at my moves for the ones that I don't have yet. Yes, it's the the second one that I don't have. The first one's the camera, the second one is the super speed boost, which I would use to break that window. It's what's really annoying is that Trouser specifically said that the sonar breaks windows, breaks glass, and clearly it doesn't. <laughs> Alright, I'm out of here. That's the only annoying part. Oh, and I have to go through the entire level again? What, wait, what was here? Was it that just a... I forget. Um... Okay, it is just the exit. I thought, for some reason, it was the continuation of that last, last area we were in. Um... But yeah, this, this year was great. 2017. Great year for games. Not just for platformers, but... Ooh... It's a molly cool. I want it. Any way to get around? No. Right. On top, and they're probably spikes. No mushrooms. I need to do this, and then do this. Yeah. But, uh. Oh, yeah! Um. Kaya, I, uh, tried out the new, the new Assassin's Creed. I did the, the whole Steam refund thing. I didn't want to try it out, maybe keep it, but, uh, got it, played for about two hours, which is the limit. And, um, it feels very different. I liked it. Um... And uh, one thing that I was looking for after seeing a lot of gameplay, seeing a lot of things about it, is the... Uh, I'm a huge fan of Metal Gear, and, you know, Assassin's Creed always has always had the stealth element to it, because, you know, they're supposed to be the, these assassins that, uh... Oh, assassinate. <laughs> but from the shadows, shadows, yeah, there's always this stealth component. So I was looking for that, for that in this game, uh, very much more than the last ones, and, uh... I was actually pleasantly surprised with it. How much more you can do with it. Hello, my name is Rextro, and here I am, show us Amazing Grit Arcade. Um, hi, Rextro, it's us, you can Laylee, remember? If you bring the game coin, you can try the latest game! These old game characters don't have very long memories, do they, Yuka? At least he's not crashed yet. Oh! Radical! I see friends have play coin. Let me do it. But yeah, I was, um, very pleasantly surprised with this. No. Assassin's Creed different? Yes, yes, I do. Bebop. Oh, please don't be killing the bees. They're so hard to kill. Two minutes game, defeat corplets, grab power-ups, get the high score. A in aerial attack. Okay. And... It looks gorgeous. Oh, I'm the bee. I'm the bee. So what's my purpose? Oh. Oh. I see. Can I... Oh, I like this. I actually like this. I felt that it has a lot of mechanics that became popular in recent time because of Metal Gear 5. The whole, uh, you know, being able to see things through either a binocular or something and, uh, tag enemies and be able to, you know, um, oh, I can't, I can't dash when I'm doing that. And be able to, uh, plan ahead because you have, like, that. Kind of binocular thing. This one has a really cool one that is the um, the eagle, right? You can fly around with the eagle, and you can really plan what your strategy is going to be to to invade a, a stronghold, which I thought was really cool. Um, I 
for a little bit, I'm, I thought that it might be a little bit OP. Um, the Eagle. Because the limitation that other games have with, uh, with this mechanic I don't think is a limitation at all. I think that the fact that, again, the binocular uh, idea that some games have, even the Far Cry games, that honestly had it before Metal Gear Solid 5, but it wasn't in every game until Metal Gear Solid 5. <laughs> so, but being able to only see from the point of view of the character, I think, is a limitation that really helps. The, I found the Eagle to be great. I really liked it. But also a little bit disorienting when you're trying to plan out the the taking over of one stronghold. Did I get a thing? Oh, beating your cape performance. How do you know? We can't remember what you had for breakfast. Oh, Rexro. Okay, now memory coming back. Rexro had to delete some blocks. Feel free to try again. Again, it's time friends beat high score. Rexro give another prize. Nice. All right. Let's play it again. Kaya says, nice, been looking for at some vids today. Thinking about getting it this summer next year. More time to play it then, yeah. Oh yeah. I think just like the last time we said we talked about it, I think waiting for a game is the best idea. I just really wanted to try it. Um Especially nowadays where the annoying thing is that patches. You know, like a game doesn't <laughs> isn't really ready until a lot later. There's full bugs, even though I didn't find any bugs. You know, Assassin's Creed, that's known for its bugs. Notoriously bad about it. Come on, little demon guy. Poor Uh, didn't find any bugs. I know that some people have found some, but as usual, you know, it's, uh, not everyone has them. And didn't find any before I have found quite a few bugs while playing. So I think really them giving it one more year did really good job for them. I am a fan of the combat. Uh, it's very... People are saying, comparing it to Zelda, I'd say it's similar to Zelda, but it's more comparable even to Dark Souls. Not to say it's a Souls-like game, because it's not. But the combat does pick good things. I like that they took the year off to be able to really learn from the games that are going on around them and really improve everything. It's a much faster game than any other Assassin's Creed, and uh, I really appreciate that as well. Did Far Cry Primal, uh, kind of said, um, Eagle kind of reminds me of the one in Far Cry Primal. I didn't play Far Cry Primal, so I'm not sure. Um, it might be exactly like that. Um, I have no idea. But if it is, that's awesome. Well, it's also one of their games, right? But I really do like that they really took the time with this one and really like improved mechanics, improved things that they hadn't since the beginning. And that's what they said that they were going to try to do with this one. I also like that this is probably actually historically accurate looking because after all they're going to use it, they're going to have an educational educational model uh, module for it coming out for free in January. Yes, wow, it was far above the record. So I'm very pleased with it. I still think that it's not as deep as I would like a game to go with all of these mechanics, but it's good. It's good. It's much improved over the last ones I played and kind of didn't feel, um, feel them very well, much, however you say that. Whoa, friends, high score, blah, 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 always the same thing. No, I do not want to play it. Thank you. What? Vendi. No, I don't. Thanks, Rextro. Let me jump off of the thing, Rextro. Hey. Thank you. Alright. Yeah, I, of all the Assassin's Creed, I'd recommend this one. I liked it. Very much. Um. Why is this here? Okay. 
What a weird positioning for all these. Oh, I think it's because I have to clean it. Huh. It, it's gonna be interesting after I clean all, all the water. There's like a good portion of it underwater. Which, you know, is not always the best thing. But, uh. Interested to see how that turns out. Hmm. I love that Steam lets you refund a game after you tried it for two hours. Uh, I find it really useful to discover if I like the game or not. Yeah. Ah, looky here! The modern heroes are back for some old Carto's dated minecart adventures. Not dated at all, Carto's. You sure these. This ain't too old, Fantron, for your modern fancy heroes. Ha! He's right. They are too old-fashioned. Let's go, Yuka. No, wait. Only joking, friends. Please ride with me. It gets very lonely out here. Yep. Lily's only joking, Cardos. Let's go for a ride. Oh, oh, who we? If we, if it's the pagey, I'll be after you. will be needing to collect 125 of the gems. Jeez. Do you need to know the controls? Yeah, let's just quickly refresh them. Head jump. X to fire. I, I didn't know about that. X to fire. But comment on this, on the whole old-fashioned thing. I don't think it's old-fashioned at all. Especially after... Oh, crap. After watching the... The, uh... Not watching. Oops. Made a mistake. I'm not doing well. <laughs> to say the least. I try I'm trying to duck. I'm accidentally trying to duck. Um, but yeah, it's not- I don't think it's outdated at all. Um, the new Donkey Kongs that have this mechanic are incredible. I, I don't know if you've seen it or played it. They do such a good job. I absolutely love the- what they've done with the- With the new Donkey Kong. It, it's such an incredible game. They did... Oh, I love it. Oh, the music. Very nice. The soundtrack to this game makes me very happy. Um... What was I gonna say? Oh yeah, like, the design in the, in the new Donkey Kongs? It's out of out of this world for a 2D platformer. It's great. I If you haven't played it, you totally should because it's uh it's very much worth it. I hate those turns. I feel that the only bad thing about this one uh specifically is the perspective. They should should have zoomed out the camera a little bit more because it's kind of hard to see where you're going or what's up next. Like, I don't know to go fast for that one turn back there. For that one jump, I mean. Where the... Where the, uh... Gems are... Like, here I'll, I'll be able to do it. Not very well. Oh, good thing I didn't go low. He had life one, partners! Um... Ooh, that was ranked among my five best rides of, in this decade. Of course, the extravagant scenery was totally unnecessary. Goodness knows how much memory that wa they wasted on that. Oh yes, a real waste. Better run now, Cardos. Uh, lots of them uh, stuff to do. You just hurry back, nah. It makes I'm trying to I'm trying to understand it. The nah, I, I don't think I've 
ever heard it. Maybe like if I hear someone with the right uh, accent saying that, it might make sense. But anyway, it makes a nice change to have somebody talk to to talk to. Nobody ever visits. So sad. So many characters in this game are so sad. Like um, Rextro, this one. It's a really, <laughs> it's a downer. It's a bit of a downer. Uh, it says, haven't played a Donkey Kong since the one on Game Boy Color. Man, <laughs> you're missing out on a lot of really good ones. The Wii one and the Wii U one are incredible. If you have a, a 3DS, the one for the Wii is on the 3DS one. And it's gorgeous. It is a gorgeous game. You know, we had terrible graphics in comparison to the other ones. was in HD. But they managed to pu pull off some beautiful, beautiful things in those. Ooh, what's this? Hey, up! Uh, who's this fella interrupting my brew? Don't mind us, we're just here to pick up the page. You will be on our way shortly. Hold up. Oh, you say now I've just missed the start of a soaps cause you appear to try to live my favorite tea cozy. <laughs> no harm done. You can always get on catch up later. And have it spoiled on social media. Core, now you've done it, lad. I'm gonna have you to squash it, ain't it? Oh, boss battle. Trev, the tentacle eye. Tenti eye. Ugh, I don't like how it pulses. Ew, <laughs> looks gross. I do like the design of it though. Come on, swing, swing. There you go. I actually like how it looks. I like the, the texture and the material that they have. How do I... Okay, that's one. That's two. That's Oh, I need to hit it twice? Three times for the back one. I see. Um... I actually got the... The... Donkey Kong for the Wii. I didn't get it on the Wii, I got it on the 3DS, which I honestly think it's better. I played it a little bit on the Wii. Uh, it's better on the 3DS because it doesn't have waggle. Uh, so I think it's vastly improve in that regard. Uh-oh. Poison water. Or is it? It is not. <laughs> it doesn't have waggle, and I think they... The Nintendo learned how to do a very good 3D for 2D platformer, where the, the background is just literally for the background, right? And, uh, I think they do a good job there. Um... Uh, it's really worth it, if you haven't picked it up. Oh yeah, <laughs> what I was just saying, I kind of didn't really... Uh, I got it for, for free from their old, uh, Nintendo, like, system that they don't, they don't have anymore. Uh, Nintendo Club, I think it was what it's called, called. now it's My Nintendo. Uh, now it's My Nintendo, but, uh, got it on Nintendo Club back in the day for free, and I was like, oh, I haven't tried this Donkey Kong yet. And had a blast. It's really incredible. Yep, back for more. Let's go. Try the tentacle. Tenti tentacle. There we go. More puns. I have a hard time reading some puns. <laughs> But the best tentacle creature in games design tentacle creatures in game design wise, I think is the Splatoon. I really like how they look, how they shine. They did a good job with spec mapping on that game. Real fan. <laughs> Kaya says uh, tentacles? <laughs> Easy. Uh, 
Who am I talking to? Well, right now, you. Just reading off some, uh... Some of the comments. Because, uh... I po I'm gonna be posting... Uh, wow, he takes two. I'm gonna be posting these, uh... On YouTube. Uh... So, because I don't have the the comments on the stream, uh, I just read them out loud, or try to. Just so it's easier. I'm glad that at least it's on Twitch, now they have the whole, like, uh, the whole... What's, what's it called? I don't know the term for it, but the replay chat. Oh. The replay chat, where you can see what people were saying originally. I think that's a really cool feature. He's swinging my way first? Yeah. Um, so there's not even need for bots on Twitch anymore for to read a comment. Ah! Forgot he does that. I think the third time, I know. This is the most annoying part. I'm gonna have a go if you think you're hard enough. Yeah, I'm so hard. How are you doing, Narcs? Have you played this game before? Or is it, are you looking into it? Uh, to possibly get it. Most of the people that come watch this one are people that have already played it. Flipping Uck! Oh, I didn't read in time. With that many eyes, you'd have thought he'd have seen it, that coming. Oh! Go on then, take the tea cozy. It's dog house for me when the missus gets home. Oh. Once again, another sad character. Creep from the deep. This is the achievement I got. Also, this is my second playthrough, if you probably saw the, the title. Um, didn't like it originally, I'm liking it a lot more this time around. I think they improved a lot of the... The problems I was having originally. So far. This world specifically, I'm finding it pretty fun. I I don't like how samey everything looks. Though, so that's my that would be my I guess can I get over there? I don't think I can. Maybe. Nope. Oh, I'm gonna die. Yeah, whatever. Games don't have lives anymore. Makes it a lot easier. I, lives were really unnecessary, in my opinion. There's no reason for it. It was very much like a leftover from the arcade day when it was important and was necessary to have them. Completely unnecessary now. Because you're just gonna keep playing it anyway. Sure you can have like a... Uh, what's it called? The word is just, just completely left me. You can have a bigger punishment for uh... Oh, it's over there. For uh, losing it a certain amount of times, I think. And to go back to a game that I just played, I think uh, Hat in Time does a good job. Actually, does it even? Actually, no, I, th I thought it did, but it doesn't. Uh, what it does, every time you die, it takes off a tick of your life. It ha you have four uh, life 
things for life points every time. And, uh... It takes off one every time you die. So, like, if you're, you have a total of four, you, uh... If you die, you have three. Then two, then one, and then if it's zero, it puts you back at the exact same spot that it would otherwise. That's where I thought that it could have done a better job and it actually put you back a little bit further. Uh, as a bigger punishment for losing. I'm a... I'm a pan of... Pan. I'm a pan! Cooking me. Uh, I'm a fan of... Uh, more rigorous punishment for... Uh, for losing. Not immediately. I think you should totally have some leeway. I don't think it should be too rigorous. But uh, I think some games should definitely consider having a little bit more punishment. I think it does add value to like you wanting to stay alive. Otherwise, you do just what I did. I'd be like, oh, I don't want to waste my time going back. I'll just kill myself in the game. And you shouldn't ever be wanting to do that in games, I don't think, personally. Maybe it's just like a, you know, an indifferent thing. Hey, welcome back, Kyle. Maybe it's just an indifferent thing, but I think that there should be the right amount of punishment in games. Look at this one. This one's crying. Where is it? So, <laughs> another sad day in the swamp for Ollie. Discarded. Unloved. All right, Hot Wheels. Got any pages in your pile of rubbish in there? <laughs> the only thing you'll find in my basket is heartbreak and despair. There's swamp trash as well, I can see it. What can you tell us about this maze thing ahead, Ollie? <laughs> it's horrible. Winding and endless. And to make things worse, the walls move and stop trespassers from grabbing the pagey at the end. <laughs> You're still interested, I suppose? Yes, I am. It doesn't sound as bad as some of the challenges we've done so far. We'll give it a go. Uh, good, good luck. Sadly, there's no light at the end of the maze for poor Ollie. Again, more depressing characters in this game. It, it's really a trend. Oh, oh, oh no. <laughs> this is terrifying. This is horrible. Get out of my way, please. Uh, ooh, what do you get to eat? Baddies. Baddies, baddies. Where am I going? Nope. Wrong way. Guess I'm going up. This doesn't seem that hard. I have 30 pages. Ah, that wasn't that bad. Pretty easy. Game overall has been decently, decently easy. Oh, there's an entrance on this side. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, don't switch the camera in a way that what, the way I'm pressing sends me back... Sends me back in. <laughs> Camera is key for platformers. I'll say it over and over again. Ooh, hello. Why are there carts in here? Sup, Blizzard Man? Wally's the name. Are you the owner of this mushroom patch? Hi, Wally. It's not ours. We're in the pagey business ourselves. Sweet! Keep it- keep that way. Uh, keep it that way. This level's my turf. I grow the tasty shrooms around here for my farmer's market stall. <laughs> I love farmer's market. The high prices keep the riffraff out. <laughs> Too right! Say, could you help me out destroying this shroom patch? I, uh, totally own it, and I'm sure I saw some gold bling inside one of them. Shrooms. Gold bling sounds good to us. 
Well, give it a go. Anything to silence that annoying voice. Sweet! Remember, unless they're all gone, they keep going back. And there must be a way to knock them all down at once. There is, my friend. There is. It's called Super Sonar Blast. Yeah, boy! Come over here for the offer of a reward you can't refuse. Oh, I can refuse it, alright. Yeah, did I ask it in my head or did I ask it out loud? Uh, what did you get to eat, Kaya? Uh, Sweet! You smashed all them shrooms! <laughs> yeah, and there's no golden loot in sight. What's the deal? I thought this was your patch. Chill, Bat Lady! The golden bling totally landed in my basket here. I always paved my muscle. Right. If anyone asks, we weren't here, cool? Cool. Alright, I need a... Need a sip of water here. Uh, there we go. Ooh, Vendi! Hey, Vendi. What's up? Hey, kids. Ready to equip a new tonic? Yes, I am. Livewire. Your power meter regenerates faster. Mmm. Collect quills. With you guys, uh... Blizzard Lash. Yeah, nothing too good. Alright, what's pants? Like every page in the game to lock this tonic. Is it literally pants? 64 bit. This is something from their stretch goals, I think. Make it look like a 64 game. I think I've been through the entire level at this point. I think. I might have not, but it certainly feels like I have. Because everything kind of looks the same. Yeah, this is swamp, yeah. Yeah. Oh, this is where I just was. I've been here. Okay. I would love a map of this area. the beginning, but there's a, a thing over there. Oh. Oh. <laughs> the entrance. Also one over there. Interesting. I wish it wasn't based on where you were looking at. I wish it was more of a just if you're in the general direction of it, but I think that could be annoying too. Not really, because you don't use the tongue to attack. And they've actually been pretty good to, about making it exclusive. Making it platform exclusive. Uh, making it exclusive. Uh, the locations where you get these guys, the hookup guys, and the other things that you would be using your, your tongue for. So, I think that would be a problem. I think I'm mostly done with this world without, uh, upgrading it. I'm gonna do that right now. Hey, guys. You'll need eight pages. I, I have eight pages. I have 31 pages. <laughs> Yeah, I'm definitely not gonna 100% this game. Um, I'm gonna save that. No, actually I'm not gonna say it, I'm just not gonna do it. It's fun. Finding it a fun game, like I've said. Not the best. I don't think it's the best. Um, 
wondering what I'm gonna play next. Lizard used pages to make the world even more amazing. More challenges await. I didn't pay attention to the beginning of it. I have no idea where this is. Wow. It's a lot bigger. <laughs> Where's the shortcut? Kaya says, it's kind of like a soft potato bread tortilla thing. Uh, got brown goat cheese in it. It's a Norwegian thing. Brown goat cheese. I don't think I've ever heard or seen that. Brown go goat cheese. I've never really had goat cheese either. I've seen it. Nor like normal goat cheese, I guess. But I've never had it. I've always been curious to try. Okay, that's the maze. I really enjoy trying new things when it comes to food. I, uh, does he add power-ups when I expand the world? No, okay. Um, yeah, I'm, like, open to try anything. I, uh, saw the, you know, they sometimes have... Well, it's been a really long time since I've watched TV, but when I was watching a long time ago, I uh, saw one of those. Is this just, is this page you just here? Oh, I see. It's a trap. It's a trap. Saw one of those shows where like, oh, eating cooked uh, cockroaches and stuff like that. But like, you know, they're proper and I just picked off the street or whatever. But I would be totally cool with eating uh, bugs and stuff like that. on it. So, soft potato bread tortilla thing. It's kind of like a spread. The goat cheese is kind of like a spread or just like something... Alright. Is this death? Oh, there's a secret area down here. Oh. Does... Ah! You're not supposed to attack me as the eye. Oh, I'm pressing the wrong button. No, no, no. Okay. Oh, they added a bridge there. I see, I see. But yeah, I'm, I'm completely open to try anything when it comes to food. I, I enjoy that, just go crazy. I forget that when they glow red, I can't hurt them. You create your own platforms. Hope he doesn't go back in. What was this for? Oh, let's see. What? Yeah, I'm supposed to be able to do that while I jump. Maybe not when I hold it. Oh, I see. I see. I've heard of quite a few Norwegian dishes recently. And, uh... They all sound really good! <laughs> I... Would actually love to try some of them. Hopefully, like, one day I can find... Some of their stuff around here. Or, like, if it's a homemade thing, hopefully I find the ingredients to make them. But, like, they sound pretty good. Not gonna lie. It's the type of food that I usually like to eat, obviously not with those ingredients or whatever. But it's the type of food that I enjoy eating, so... 
I like cheese. <laughs> I like bread, you know. Some people don't. Like... Cheese? And I'm like, what? Cheese to me was like such a... Natural thing, you know? You just put cheese in the bread. You just put cheese in sandwiches. Some people are just like, I hate cheese. Cheese is like, not a part of it. Like my normal... Not normal, but like, part of stuff that... I ate at all. It's like, that's so weird. I just kind of like, took cheese for granted. <laughs> that's something I never thought I'd say. Whoa, the enemies just popped up right behind me. Do they do that every time? They do, oh my word. But I... What is this? Slices of goat cheese and you roll it up. Mmm. -hmm. Okay. The point of this. I wonder how delayed the stream is for you. Cause like... I'm getting your responses way, way later. Oh look, it's uh, I forget your name. Bones, bones, right? Hello there, done... Well done surveying one world without being captured and cooked. Hello! I didn't expect to see the other other adventurers way out here. Actually, you might be able to help me obtain my next artifact. Treasure hunting. From the look of... From the look of you... I don't think your heart's in it. There's a valuable gem hidden inside that cave, however. It's behind thick glass. And a modest explorer like me has no chance of breaking. You think you could retrieve the gem for me? In exchange, I'm sure to source one of those golden pages that are all the rage these days. Alright, lazy bones, we'll find your... Oh, wonderful. Please bring the treasure straight to me once you've recovered it. I'll do it. Oh, this is terrible. Oh, I see. Ow. Are you here, Jen? Oh, this camera in tights. Is that it? Got it! We really are next gem adventurers. Thank goodness, bring it back. Yeah, yeah. I think it's this way. Yes, it is. That was easy. Alright. We've recovered the gem. My goodness, and just when I was about to give up and find another buddy duo. We found some other collectibles up and uh, whatever, whatever. Please accept this gold trinket as a sign of my appreciation. Some of the swamp creatures were using it as a napkin. I think I've earned a break from all this excitement. Till we meet again. Is there no transformation in this level? I don't like how the... Like, I don't mind it too much, but I'm not a fan. As in, like, I find it slightly creepy that they turn. But I think they turn too slowly for it to be too creepy. Like, if they kept up a little bit better, I think I'd be more creeped out by them. Is this new water? This is new water. This shortcut? Hmm. Interesting. Oh, shortcut. I hate the jellyfish. 
I'm gonna die. Ooh. Uh, Kaya says, uh, I'm not a huge fan of cheese myself. Only eat a few types on pizza. It's got to be... And on pizza, it's got to be mo mozzarella. Um... Hmm. I'm trying to think about pizzas. I, uh... Pizza. <laughs> you can tell I'm really trying to think hard because I'm not doing anything in the game. <laughs> I'm trying to think what other cheeses I have on pizza. I'm not a big fan of, like... Pizzas that have a bunch of different cheeses in it, like a cheese mixture. A uh, popular one around here is like four cheese types together. It's mozzarella. I'm not exactly sure, like the combination of the other ones, but it's definitely mozzarella. It has a uh, uh, gorgonzola. I think that's how you say that. And uh, <laughs> I'm almost also discovering that I've never had to say all any of these cheeses out loud. I, f I forget what combination of four cheeses it is, but it's a four cheese mix. And I don't like it too cheesy. T tastes too strong for me. Not a fan. I think I like... Is this an order thing? Did I just do it in the right order? Okay. First try. I'm guessing this one won't be as simple. Or is it? Huh. I don't get the puzzle. Oh, it's time, guys. I think, yeah, I think I usually just like mozzarella on my pizza as well, when it comes to cheese. But, like, other than that, when it, for the other ingredients, other than the cheese, I'm pretty liberal. I will have almost anything on my pizza. I'm not a picky eater. At all. Like, I will have anything. was something I never really stopped to think about. The cheese component of pizzas. Huh. It's very interesting. That I never really put much thought there. I guess it's not something people spend a lot of time thinking about. gonna make it eventually. There we go. <sighs> There's the exit. Was there anything else here? Oh, uh, camera, come on. I finished the challenge. This is where it came from. I thought there was something else here. Alright. I'm not- like, I like pizza, but I don't think that it's near my favorite, like, foods. I eat it fine, completely fine, it's just not. Some people, like, live and die by pizza. <laughs> I'm definitely not one of those people. I just enjoy pizza. Like a normal amount of enjoyment <laughs> from pizza.
My my family is really big on pizza. They love pizza. <laughs> like pretty much the rest of my family. So I'm the I'm I'm the odd one out. You know, it's not like so many of the <laughs> of the movies and thing are like the dad's disappointed because the kid doesn't like cars or whatever. My my parents are disappointed because I don't like pizza. <laughs> That's not true, by the way, but I think if anything, that would be the closest thing they would probably be disappointed in me for. They don't really care. They're not the type of person, the people that are like, you disappoint me because of the person you are. They're pretty chill. Yeah. I need to do a high jump for this? Oh, there's timing here. Oh, I need to feed you! <laughs> Probably have to do this whole maze part really fast. Yeah, I do. Oh, I hate those. Kaya says, A typical pizza place cheese here is a doesn't taste anything like doesn't taste anything yellow cheese. It's kind of it's just kind of there. Completely botched your comment, by the way. Um, no, yeah, I agree. I've had those. It's the worst. Like, no tasting cheese is the worst. And I've definitely had some of those. I haven't been here, have I? Hello. If Lizard want Pagey, reach, at, reach the end of the course before time runs out. Also, Lizard, no turn off... Lizard, not turn off power while save icon screen. Otherwise, definitely not get Pagey. Let's say. What? Yeah, sure, I'll do it. What's the whole... I'm so confused. Okay. Oh, this sucks. <laughs> there we go. Let me try again. We have, we definitely have those pizzas. I forget, I can't do that. Is it faster on this side? It's not. Oh, okay. I don't remember where I was hearing people say this, but apparently like Domino's and England, I don't know, Cleo, any other place, but Domino's in England is actually like supposed to be really good. I had no idea. It's really bad here. <laughs> Is it this way? Uh, I'm going to- no, I'm going the right way. Just don't kill anything. Just go, just go. I'm not gonna do it in time. Let go. Is that the last one? No, I had two more. That's not enough time. Where is the beginning? Uh, oh, it's right under me. Cool. Oh, I missed! <laughs> This is gonna be it for me. Can you not say the whole thing every time, please? Alright. It's this way. I can't fly. I can't fly.
Where is this? It should be around, right? It should be around. Yeah. Hello again. Come on, it was right there. I forget that you need to kind of be aiming with the camera, not just the character. That's pretty annoying. That's not that way. Like, this is really annoying. They should just bring me back to the beginning instead of making me go through this. <laughs> Every time, just losing life, losing life. The bee was in front of it. Well, that's it. <laughs> yeah, this challenge is just annoying. Like, the challenge itself is fine, it's just, like, how you die and the other things is just... annoying. I'll keep trying it, though. Luke, forget I can't fly. It's so natural, it just becomes such a natural part of the game. Can I turn it off? <laughs> I want to turn off my moves. Um, I'm not curious. Twenty-five. Okay. Why? Yeah, I know, it's... Uh, I'm really gonna take some time there. <laughs> Cause, uh... I flew! <laughs> this is driving me insane! <laughs> Why can't I fly and then use the tongue? It has good reach. Okay, I don't even need to get up. I'm just gonna try this out. Okay, I don't even need to jump. I'm just not gonna jump. He has such good range, but only if he is looking at it. <laughs> Can he reach here? Okay, I'm, I'm not even gonna worry about it anymore. I've been trying to do it the hard way, clearly. Then jump on the box. Jump on here. Can he reach this? Yes, he can. Alright, good to know. I can do the entire thing. Oh, and this is... I get it. I get why the pipe is here now. Oh, where's the, entr the entrance to this? Uh... I know. Oh, that's a sad animation. <laughs> he just like falls backwards dead. It's dark. I like it. Alright, now I know I don't need to jump to do it. Because he has differing lengths he can do it <laughs> by. 
And this challenge becomes very much a non-challenge. Come on. Fire. But like, it, it makes sense that you'd try to jump. Still pretty tight time. This level they've been a lot better with um, with the time. It actually is a little bit challenging. Which I do very much appreciate. Um I think I did the whole go around here. Did I do the center area? I did, right? That's the... That's the thing. You know, the thing. Hey, there's one over there. Let me try getting that one. I think that's one of the best things games can do. It's making it so... Okay, how do I get this one? It's making it so, uh... fire one. Where does it begin? It looks like it starts here. Fireproof. Completely forgot. Oh, I'm toxic waterproof too. Fire makes me toxic waterproof. those types of challenges. Sad that I hope that in this pipe it's just a bunch of those. Like a kind of like a course for those sinking ones. Those tend to be pretty challenging and pretty fun. Hey it is a course. Help capital B's goons stuck me behind this awful platforming course. Awesome, I love platforming courses. You'll need to be quick to beat his time blocked. Yeah. I'm fine with that. <laughs> too easy. <laughs> it's too easy. <laughs> I want my platforming challenges to be harder. <laughs> Probably one of the few people that complain about platforming challenges being too easy. I just like my platforming challenges to be extremely hard. Is that my phone that's buzzing? It is. Getting to turn that off. Not off, but... I like that they all have, like, the don't disturb mode now. Very helpful. Still receive everything, just... <clears throat> Doesn't make any sound. Probably, it was something that was on Android for years, but... My nice little old-timey iPhone. Now it has it. 
Do I, did I get everything? Oh, there's stuff over, over there I haven't been to. Okay. There's also a path that goes sideways here. Let's this way. Let's this. Is there a light here? Oh, too far, friends. I need these quills. Just backtrack or anything. <clears throat> oh, what are these? What are those? Oh, you're gonna tell me. Ah, oh, good. It's the gardeners. Actually, we're not... Look at the state of my garden. My mushrooms will never grow in this dump. Well, we... Listen, I'll give you a deal. Regrow my mushrooms and I won't get you sacked. Just take the, the seeds from that tree and put them in the mud holes. But go on then, get to work and start planting seeds from that tree. Sure. Is it time? Uh -huh. <sighs> Come on then, Laylee. Let's plant some seeds. Not timed. How, how does this work? Oh, it is time. Yeah. Oh, it's annoying. <laughs> Go in the mud! There we go. Huh. Okay, this... This challenge officially sucks. <laughs> it's... The controls aren't nearly good enough. Pull this off. <laughs> I was right there. Oh, you let me do it again! Thank you. I still got my S3. Am I. Oh, do I have to talk to you again? I think I'm missing the meaning of that. My, it might just be a huge brain fart, and I don't remember. But I, I don't think I know what you're talking about, but maybe I do? Come on. You gotta be kidding me. <sighs> Please just. Come on. No. <sighs> One second left. <laughs> All right. Clear the path first. Oh, that's, that's fun. I see how you, you made this one harder. Oh, and you regrew everything. Great. I love it. Please, no. I want. <sighs> Alright. I'm, I'm probably gonna give up on this challenge. It's really annoying. <laughs> Where did it go? Uh... Oh! <laughs> okay, yeah. 
Yeah, I, I don't know. The, the stream seems to be on a huge delay. Uh, Kaya just said, yeah, you were talking about your iPhone. Yeah. So the S3 is the Galaxy S3. Okay, I'm not gonna do this. This is the worst challenge ever. I can't get through half of it. Not because, like, it's... Hard? Well, it is hard, because the controls are really annoying for pushing a thing. <laughs> If the controls were a little bit better, I'd totally do it. It's not fun either. <laughs> hey, Vendi, what's up? Are there two Vendis here? I unlocked something new, didn't I? Fall proof. Oh, this is useful. I'm still gonna go with Baller, though. Just way more useful. I think I pretty much got everything here. I, uh... Yeah. Did I get up there? I'm gonna try getting up there. On the tree. No, I am not doing this again. I know I did get up there, that's just the, the climbing segment. Alright! I think I'm pretty much done with this level. I got a good amount. There's only, what, three? Not three, like nine or eight left for this level. Which is fine. Like, I've been over the necessary. Yeah, I have six left in this level. I'm fine. I did all the ones I wanted to do before it. While it's still fun. Still finding it fun. I'm gonna force myself to hunt down the last few. Especially since there are some that... I still need upgrades to reach. I'm glad that the comfort level for finding these is actually pretty, like good. Like, all of this I've done still having fun with all of it has, hasn't felt like a chore trying to get all of these um... And it's way past the required limit. Which is very nice. I'm, I don't have to, like, hunt a horn fiber up there. Nice. I already don't remember this level. Okay. Button. Stay back, you ugly evil corpulent minions! You'll never take me alive! Kung Fu Kick! <laughs> I, I did enjoy that. Oh dear, at least he didn't develop his Stockholm Syndrome. None of them have! <laughs> Yuka? Back off! Can I get him? I mean, it probably can, but... I got him. You've not heard the last of me! Okay, so this is where I entered. Alright. I hear another... another sparkly. It's not like it's flying around me. Oh, it's underwater. I just need to... Uh, do this business. Are you attacking me? Yes, you are not. I'll do that. Anyway. Ooh, it's a track. Great. Have you been feeling that, uh, like, this game is too easy? I'm just, like, really walking through it? Because I've been feeling like that playing it. <laughs> like, it, it feels too easy. 
Not like crazy, right? There, there are a few points that are a little bit more challenging, but... For the most part, it feels on the easy side. This poison gonna hurt me. No. I should go under and actually do this. Oh, this is where I had to go through. I completely forgot. Back off, jellyfish. Back off. Oh! There's a glitching monster. He got me. Wow, that's a lot better for you. Meet me in the boardroom. I'm waiting to land the key. Beats right on your face. Ooh, space! Space! I'm kinda excited for that, now that I saw that icon. I don't wanna see space. Oh no, World 4. Here it is. The world I've been loathing a little bit. That's the shortcut. World 4. Get a swig of the old water. Oh no. Oh no. Welcome back to the Quackfire Quiz, where you're about to witness a multiple choice massacre. Oh no, not this again. I haven't been paying attention to anything. Me neither. As usual, there are ten questions that you need answer answering correctly, and only three lives, mawahaha. Now, step forward and prepare for the exam extermination. <laughs> Moody Maze marches rusty trolleys. Which one wears the stupid hat? It's, uh, Jolly. Jolly. Nope. Do pay attention. That was... Quite. So I just saw your comment, yeah, it kind of looks easy seeing you play it right now. This is the moment where I saw it. So maybe you can gauge, like, the time difference. Maybe there's a problem with how I'm outputting it. If it's, like, becoming more and more delayed. Anyway, do pay attention. The easiest question of the bunch, of course. Uh, Pages, legal property of Ivory Tower. How many do you have in total? Oh, oh, oh. It's either this one or this one. 158, okay. I hope you're not looking at your cell phone. The ridiculous fishbowl freak Dr. Puzz. What is her second transformation? Oh, I didn't even meet that one. Snow player, because it was a snow world. Bring out the next question. Yeah, I did it. Quickly. I get a double. The picture, where was it taken? I have the palace. I just need two more. A character, who is it? That's Ollie. Glass, you definitely read that answer in reflections in my glasses. The picture, where was it taken? That's the eagle of the bad guys. Eagle village. What does she need to do to save Lara? Oh, I didn't read the... That was a guess. <laughs> that was a wild guess. I had two lives anyway, so I was fine. But I don't even know who that character is. I don't think I met her. That was just a, a wild, wild guess. <laughs> I'm glad it paid off.
I'm trying to think what game to play next. I definitely want to keep on with platformers. Do you have any suggestions? Uh, and also on YouTube later, if anyone has any suggestions, please comment it below. <laughs> Kai just said, Kay, that was creepy when you said, I hope you're not looking at your phone. I was, well. Hey kids, ready to cook? Oh yeah, I forget that you don't have anything to go. Oh, it's evil letters. We're on the back side of the thing now. I'm guessing that's world five over there. No, it's not. Hmm. Go to world world four. Trouser, what's my new move? Welcome, I see you made it to my special branch. Lovely views here, eh? I hope you don't charge extra for them. You're getting close to your missing book. I actually did that <laughs> by accident. Uh, clinch it without my next free charge maneuver. This next move will allow you to master the art of stealth. Yes, stealth. Like that. Time I snuck into Capital B's shed and helped myself to his garden tools. Yeah, yeah, yeah. To perform camo cloak, simply hold and left trigger and press B. <laughs> Thanks, Trouser. We'll give it a go. Yeah, yeah. Excellent! Remember everything I've taught you, and you're sure to succeed. <laughs> Ooh, oh, I just stay invisible. Interesting. Oh, I forgot I'm gonna do that. Not supposed to eat it, we're supposed to catch it. That's one really annoying thing. I don't like that they use the same power up. I, I get that it makes it more convenient, but it's so confusing sometimes. Do I hurt you? Oh, I'm getting out of the way. No. Camera, you're really not helping. <laughs> if you're gonna have a battle like this with this kind of movement, you need really need a camera that will stay behind you. Not like fit behind the character, but be will stay in position, I'll say. That's better. Get past the next door and you'll need twelve to wait twelve hours or simply play pay one ninety nine for Special B coins. Timely. Timely, my friend. That is the great problem nowadays, isn't it? <laughs> Microtransactions. It really sucks that... Oh, it's stealth. I'm just... Microtransactions are the big new craze. Yeah, we can do the camera. I was debating in my head if I should do that now or later. What do you think? 